So when Oprah reached out and said, hey, would you like to check out our smartphone that charges in 30 minutes? I'm like, yeah, I mean, who doesn't want a smartphone that charges that fast? But is it actually true? Well, we're going to go ahead and put this uh, against the top smartphones in terms of battery charge speed test. I'm talking about the OnePlus 7T, the Galaxy Note 10 Plus, and the Huawei Mate 30 Pro. All of them do really well with OnePlus 7T being the king in about 56 minutes. But we're talking 30 minutes here. Now, the Oppo Reno Ace comes with a 4,000 milliamp battery, so it is the third largest battery within this whole list of devices we have here. And it comes with a 65 watt charger. Think about that, 65 watt, massive. I haven't seen that come in any smartphone. You can get third party chargers, but this is pretty big. Now, without wasting any more time, guys, let's start charging. All right, so let's start things off. Now, our devices, in terms of battery sizes, Oppo has 4,000, OnePlus 3,800, um, Galaxy 30, uh, 43, Mate 30 Pro is at 4,500. As you can see, I've turned all the devices on so that it can be at the same rate, and Oppo is moving really fast right now. We're gonna check at the five minute mark just to quickly see where it is. And at five minutes, it is at 24%. That is insane. That's at 10% for the OnePlus 7T, the Galaxy is at 10, and the Mate 30 Pro is at 13. That's ridiculous. At five minutes, 24% charge, which is fantastic. That's great. It means that, look, you can quickly top off your device if even if you had zero juice on there, you've got enough for you to just get the dig going, which is great. So we're going to move on to, to 10 minutes, 20, 30, and then we'll see what a or what else we can do with the rest of the time we have. All right, we're getting to that 10 minute mark and we're gonna check the Oppo uh, Reno Ace and then, ooh, 47%. Uh, the OnePlus 7T is at 22, the Galaxy is at 22, Mate 30 Pro is at 26. 47%, it's almost at 50% in 10 minutes. <laughs> That's absolutely nuts. If 50, yeah, it, 10 minutes is 50%, it's insane. It's absolutely insane that a smartphone can do this. Whew, okay, let's move over to the 20 minute mark. At this point, I mean, it's, it's a no brainer. Again, it's a 4,000 milliamp battery. So it's a sizable battery there. It's not a small battery in this device. Uh, granted, two other devices have bigger batteries, but it's still a sizable battery and 65 watt charger really is, is running the paces right now. So we can clearly see at 20%, uh, sorry, at 20 minutes, it is 83% for the Ace. Uh, OnePlus 70 is 45. The Galaxy is 43% and Mate 30 Pro is at 48. So 20 minutes, 83%. It looks like we are going to get that 30 minutes that they promised. I mean, uh, that is really, really good. Now we're just going to keep that up. And I love the fact they've got that, just a charging indicator there, kind of showing you how well it's doing in terms of charging speeds and how fast this device is. We're getting close to 30, 30 minutes. Let's see, let's see, 30 minutes up. Oh, we passed 30 minutes, it didn't hit at 30 minutes. Uh, we'll see what we get with this device. Is it gonna be close? It's gonna be around 32 minutes, I, I would say. Just guessing through this and um, yeah. And the other devices are still not even anywhere close. I mean, you can see where the Galaxy is and where the Mate 30 is. And yes, it's, um, yeah, 100% at 32 minutes and 30 seconds uh, for the <laughs> Oppo Reno Ace. That is insane. I mean, that is absolutely insane. Now, of course, some of you are wondering, okay, is does this thing run really hot? Is it, you know, what are the temperatures? That kind of crazy thing. So let's check the temps for it and see what we actually get for temperatures. Uh, and just measuring here, it was about 90 degrees, which is pretty cool. So you know what? I'm gonna put it down and uh, grab some breakfast. Okay, so, I mean, there's gotta be a few things we can talk about with this device while the other phones charge. Taking a closer look at the Oppo Reno Ace, it's got a 6.5 inch display, nice looking display. We can see the wallpaper on there. Uh, it's got a teardrop notch. 
Now, other things you find feature-wise, it does have a headphone jack, so that's actually pretty cool. Um, and as you know, USB Type-C port for that fast charging. Now, this is powered by the Snapdragon 855 Plus processor. So in terms of gaming, this is the device that will do a lot of gaming for you. 12 gigs of RAM, up to 12 gigs of RAM, UFS 3.0 storage. So when playing games like Call of Duty Mobile, you're getting really fast, smooth gameplay. And that's toppled with the 90 hertz refresh rate of the display, which it can be locked at 90 hertz. So you do have that built in, which is great. And that's absolutely fantastic. Um, and you also have got some really good speakers in terms of audio. Sounds really good. I mean, decibels is like 101. 0.9 or so uh, but overall this device is solid now let's go ahead and check the other devices as we're talking here the oneplus 7t finishes at 57 minutes and one uh one second uh the mate 30 pro comes up next at 64 minutes and rounding up the whole quartet here is the galaxy note 10 at 68 minutes Whew. It's been a fun test. Yeah, I mean, it is impressive. The fact that he took 32 minutes, yes, it's not 30, but my, who's counting? Seriously, 32 minutes to charge my device from zero to 100. Truly insane. Allowed me to do other things like game, check out the device more, all that fun stuff, which you saw. But think about it. In five minutes, it was 24%. At 20 minutes, it was 84%. That is insane. I mean, and the fact that the temperature stayed relatively cool on this device while charging, again, huge plus there. I mean, I like what I see. Plus, you've got the fact that, look, it's got the Snapdragon 855 Plus. It's got a 90 hertz display. It stays at 90 hertz. It doesn't actually drop down. Um, and you can actually do some really good gaming on this device. Truly impressive. Now, if you want to find out more about the Oppo Reno Ace, use the link down below. Uh, this device uh, is currently available in China. Uh, hopefully we'll see it uh, around the world soon. But I've got to say, I am impressed with this right here from Oppo. And whew, I'm excited to see more companies do this. Again, charging speeds are better. Again, uh, they've done a good job here. And look, my mind's blown. Anyway, guys, leave your thoughts down below. What do you think about charging your smartphone in about 30 minutes? Now that you've seen it happen, do you want your smartphone to actually do that? Leave those comments down below. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe to the channel, and always enjoy your entertainment.